Welcome to Paradise TV. I'm Stephanie Summers. And I'm Carly Wagner. Tonight we're here at the Seminole Casino Mockley for an all new show. There is a lot to do here tonight as well as a lot of paradise to see. So let's go ahead and get a quick look at what's coming up in tonight's show. In tonight's show, photography is um, a lot of manual labor, at least in the way I do it. He's one of the most famed landscape photographers on the planet, and he calls Paradise home. We spend a day with Clyde Butcher, then... Look at the size of this thing. We're taking a bite out of one of the most mouth-watering burgers you can find here in Southwest Florida. And... It's great right now. <laughs> I mean, get out of the water, go fishing now. Copy that. We're at the Fort Myers Boat Show, and we'll take you there. Also, I mean, that is the home run from the visitor experience. We show you where you can find this trifecta of nature. All that and more in the next half hour. Clyde Butcher is an American photographer known all over the world for his landscape photography. I mean, after all, he's been bringing pictures to the masses since the 60s. Yeah, his black and white photographs have made him a living legend. We recently were lucky enough to spend some time with him, and tonight, Paradise TV is giving you an inside look at the man behind the lens. Look at the oaks. I like these oaks. Most would agree that Florida is a photographer's paradise. This little tree here has got a lot of neat texture in it. But there are very few photographers who can capture our state's beauty like Clyde Butcher. And what I usually do, if you, if you look at my composition, there's nothing really at the center. It's these, this tree and that tree is guiding you out into the water. And it's the process behind Clyde's award-winning photographs that are a rare art form all in itself. If I did this shot today, it would be a month or two before I could see a picture of it. In today's digital world, that almost seems unimaginable. And it's here in Clyde's studio and darkroom where you can truly see how unique the process and his equipment is. For example, this machine is one of his eight enlargers. This is 11 by 14. It was built in 1932. Each enlarger creates prints of different sizes. So you put the negative in here and then it projects. It used to be a camera, but we just reversed the process and made it a larger out of it. And with a careful eye and precision, no two prints are ever the same. It controls the contrast of the print. It's really interesting. What we're doing right now is what I used to do in the 60s and 70s. And it's not to say that Clyde never uses modern technology, but when you have perfected a technique like he has, it's hard to picture why Clyde would want to capture paradise any other way.